how I personally relate to Jody as a person. Jody is a lot more like who I wish I were. Um, she has a gun. <laughs> I should not have a gun. <laughs> um, she thinks about shit a lot harder than I do. I tend to be really reactive in spite of getting rid of all the reasons I used to think I was reactive, I'm still, apparently, um, pretty, uh, uh, I do dumb shit all the time! <laughs> I just don't think! And, like, somebody, I also have this gut instinct where people will be like, alright, here's the line, and I'll go, really? What was it for? <laughs> but I got the edge of the cliff. Right! <laughs> <laughs> I just, and Jody just seems like somebody who's methodical. She doesn't take shit personally. She looks at the facts. And I'm sorry, as far as I'm concerned, feelings are facts. <laughs> I'm pretty sure, because my feelings were hurt, you meant to hurt them and you suck. <laughs> like, that's not true. Feelings aren't facts, and I should get my shit together sometimes. Um, so Jody is, Jody's uh, much more methodical than I am. I think I'm nicer than she is, yes. <laughs> but probably only because I'm a little more obsessed with what people think of me than she is. <laughs> Which again, not such a great trait. So, the short answer to your question is, if I could wake up tomorrow and be Jody, would I? Yeah, that'd be cool. <laughs> <laughs> It's not my doing. 
It's not me. It's a connection and it's the way it's received. So I thank you. I can't take credit for it. I take credit for the environment and for the spirit that keeps us together and for the way people receive it. So I thank you for that. I accept it. Um, but not all of it is mine to accept. Thank you. Take 